Hey, well and all, welcome to another episode of the Nerd Today Podcast. I'm your host, your doctor recommended dose of nerdiness, aka your nerd today. And we are here with something special. Oh my god, can you see the link? Can you see can you see the quotes? Or not the quotes, even the, the title. God, I'm so excited. I'm messing this up already. You see the title, you see the thumbnail, you see my joy in my face. I don't have a good ninja ninja turtle shirt. I have one that's like super faded though, because I've worn it for very long and I haven't changed in between filming other reviews so i've been wearing the same shirt for a while and i forgot honestly so these are all filmed on the same day just the mystery's gone i'm sorry i've broken everything you trust i'm, I'm so sorry <laughs> but as i break your trust and um i want to i want you to stay i want you to stay um like the people who stayed at patreon.com slash nerd today and support me over here like matt and maggie <laughs> hopefully awesome jesus that's a horrible segue uh, Jeff Fellship, Brandon, Susan, and my brother from another mother, co-host at Even Work Podcast. That's right. I have a wrestling podcast, and it is absolutely amazing. Uh, Michael Raspass, thank you so much. Um, if you want to support me over at patreon.com slash day, check out below. There's links on the audio and video version of this. And finally, if you want to check out my wrestling podcast, there's also a link below as well. But let's get into the review proper of... Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Heroes in the Half Shell. This game is awesome. Developed by Tribute Games and published by Dot Emu. Don't you? Not sure what you guys name. I'm so sorry. The Dot Emu. I feel I want to call it Dot Emu. Played on an Xbox Series X. Thank God for Game Pass. Story. With Bebop and Rocksteady assaulting Channel 6 and stealing the super gnarly devices to support Krang and Shredder's latest twisted plan, the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Shredder's Revenge sees the turtles battling across righteous range of timeless TMNT locations from Manhattan to Coney Island, to city rooftops to dank sewers, and help the fearsome foursome trounce the foot soldiers, Triceratons, and the rock troops all the way to Dimension X. Gameplay. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Shredder's Revenge features modernized gameplay rooted in timeless classic brawling mechanics brought to you by beat em up experts at Daimu and developed by Tribute Games in partnership with Nickelodeon. Bash your way through gorgeous pixel art environments and slay tons of hellacious enemies with your favorite turtle, each with their own skill and moves, making each one unique. Choose a fighter, use radical combos to defeat your opponents, and experience intense combats uh, or intense combat, pardon me, loaded with breathtaking action and outrageous ninja abilities. Stay sharp as you face off against Shredder and his faithful foot, foot Clan alone, or grab your best bud and play with up to four players simultaneously. All right, spoiler section time. So when it comes to this game, the attention to detail is incredible. The locales, the color palette are perfectly in sync with what the TMT cartoon uh, many of us grew up with. As well as having the four original turtles return to do voice work for this game gives that extra cherry on top of this delicious cake. So I, I listen. I know it should try to make some kind of piece of joke there, but you know, what am I going to give you? You know. Anyway, moving on <laughs> to the characters. Each playable character feels unique and fun to play with. I had a lot of fun playing with uh, April and Neo over at Neon Pocket Dimension, their uh, Twitter stream last year when we were playing, trying to get six people at one time. Uh, over Game Pass, and once you beat the game, getting Casey Jones is so much goddamn fun. That's truly the crux of the whole game. is fun. It's fun. Finally, one last touchstone for me is music. It's insane. I clipped out my re my reaction to the Shredder boss fight, which you can see below. And when the music hits, I still get goosebumps thinking about that moment. Negative for me personally, I, I didn't have anything negative to say about this experience it's a perfect evolution of arcane beat-em-ups from the last from the past part of me with modern sensibilities negatively i'd say you would have to be a fan of tmnt beat-em-ups or both to enjoy this experience but honestly it's beautiful all right so verdict time what else can be said about this game other than it's damn near perfect of a game buy this game it's on Game Pass if you have Xbox Game Pass as well on your phone, thanks to Netflix Gaming if you have Netflix, which you most likely do. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles is the apex of beat-em-ups, the apex of Ninja Turtles games, and for me, on the Nerdy Day scale, it gets a 5 out of 5. Amazing. 
All right, ladies and gentlemen, my non-binary folk out there. That's my review of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Shredder's Revenge. Um, God, but just, uh, I mean, I already said it before, but just to summarize, man, what, what a beautiful goddamn game. I just... I can't believe in the year of our Lord 2023, I'm able to play a Ninja Turtles game and it just be what I thought Turtles in Time was, but even better. Uh, seriously, the art style is just absolutely insanely gorgeous. The gameplay is way better and easier to play than ever before. Uh, it being on Game Pass, I mean, it's on PS5 and all, don't get me wrong, and Switch, but game pass is just a beautiful place for it so many people can play you play it right now if you have a game pass please do me a favor play that game right now it, it's fun play through that first level you know you're already paying for game pass just try it out um it's just i've been a lifelong ninja turtles fan um a lot of my emotional high moments are from ninja turtles as i mentioned before if you've watched my ninja turtle comp like content you know the the 2007 movie is like one of my favorite movies because it the culmination of like me taking my parent to go see it like she did when i was a kid and her sitting with me watching my old vhs's back to back to back just placating me and then she was so excited to go see the movie that i got to treat her as an adult for once you know ninja turtles just holds a beautifully special place in my heart and this game is like the perfect cherry on top of that cake. As I mentioned, yeah, I should make a pizza pun here or then, but you know, it's hard to put a cherry on top of a pizza unless you're Michelangelo. Um, but before I ramble too much, I just, I love this game so much and thank you Tribute and, and Dime you. I, I'm just, hope we get more. Um, can you guys do X-Men next? That'd be awesome. Like a new X-Men game, like the arcade game or Simpsons. That'd be cool. Uh, like, let's just keep going with this like formula so I can play games from my childhood that I remember playing in the arcades. But yeah, that's going to be it for me today. Um, thank you so much for rocking with me in this review. Um, as you guys know, the intro is special for me. So everyone who stopped by, thank you so much. I love you all. I'll catch you in the next one because my name is Carlos Rodriguez. Your doctor recommended dose of nerdiness. And I want you all to be good people.